You know, you just suggested a couple of fights ago. Oh, nice uppercut. Digging straight left. Second Four time for this, rather. Two. And that was with that uppercut. A straight right here. Hey, Linares from Venezuela. Go ahead, Mike. There was that uh, fight stands uh, dead even. If I was in there with him, I just want to. Oh, he got clipped with the left hand that time. For that, I haven't seen John tonight, but I know he loves this. There's that uppercut there from Cambosis, and jab to the body, left hook to the head. Not thinks that he's getting this guy to move. He won't real. I don't think George Cambosis likes anyone, to be honest. Anyone who's standing in front of him, he has a good degree. Cambosis has just got his rhythm, but he, he's creating. And that's why I like this referee, letting him fight on the inside. Those are hard body shots. You, you see what Cambosis did, though? He, he showed with his shoulders, he shaked with his... Still been an action-packed fight throughout, including the sixth round. Henrix lets him go inside. He just said... Round six continues. And let's see if they can take advantage of it. The thing about style again is Bella. She's, she's an entertaining fighter to watch. I love watching this kid fight. And Cambosis is so tough. So disciplined in this fight, and this guy. There's that straight left of Cambosis. Wonder if they caught the uh, head clash there. Good strength on the inside from Cambosis as well. And that's a step over right hand, something we often see there from Russian go. fighters. Here in Auckland, New Zealand. The left hook is there for Cambosis if he sets it up. Landed it three or four times. Now he's on the inside. cards if it's stopped. How do you not? Well, you know, Bella doesn't know if he's behind in this fight because but it hasn't slowed him down too much. There's that uppercut again and again. This mic, as you know, is when it can be really big. Joshua's uppercut. Watching the fighters waiting for it all night. Nice straight right hand. Another right hand by George. Cambosis, he changed angles there. That's what he did there. And then he did it beautifully. Changed angle through the left hook, and now he's back to the right hand again. He's hitting and sitting down. That's the, the left hook going to work. It's cut in this round, and that's... I've struggled to give Bella a round since round one. There's that south four left, and there's that uppercut, and it has been there again and again and again. Bang! Oh. There's the push down. Dan Rex, the referee, was wide on top of that. You know, the tendency when you're in a fight is to do that. But all he had to do was throw another punch. He probably would have got underneath the right eye of Bella, plus the cut. Take a step back. Tries to get a second. And he's been like the Energizer Bunny. Under control, too. A terrific job. Nice left hook landed in there. Cambos is all over, though. He's doing all the scoring. A good head control there as he turned him out as well. Boy, I'll tell you, for the amount of shots that Bella's taken. Died. You can see why he's taken plenty of those. Both these boys, heavily early. Well, I guess Cambosis, uh, ranked number 10. A good man to fight for a world title. Dangerous punch to throw. for complaining. Oh, look at this. How do you like this fight? I love it. Wow. Uppercut. Left hand. 20 seconds to go. They don't get any better than this. If you like a prize fight, this is better than war. And down finally he goes. That's the first time he scored down. Counts up to five and six. Danrix might as well stop this. There's no sense in him taking it anymore. Well, I think if we look at the replay. And that's it. It's all over. Danrix let him go on on his feet. That's a big, big fight. But Cambosis and I get... He's well behind. There was the first right hand, the second, and the third. I have to say... Blue. 